Tonight with breaking news, one man shot after Milwaukee police officers opening fire during a domestic violence incident. Casey Cronus joins us live near 84th and Congress with an update from Milwaukee police. Casey. Well, Bill, police haven't released the identity of that man yet, but they say he is a 34 year old Milwaukee man on parole for first degree reckless homicide and wanted for violating that parole. Now, before police knew his identity, though, they received a domestic violence related call with reports of someone being battered. When officers first arrived on scene around 615 tonight, they say they encountered a man who matched a description they were given. Here's what unfolded when those officers spotted their suspect. The suspect fled on foot from officers. One of the officers pursued him. That individual turned while armed with a gun. Shots were fired by that individual. The officer fired shots at that individual, striking him, and he sustained a non life threatening injury. Now, police won't say who fired their weapon first, only that both that suspect and one officer did fire shots. The officer involved is a 32 year old veteran with four years on the job. No officers were injured. And again, that suspect was arrested, taken to a local hospital where he is expected to be OK. In the meantime, MPD's homicide unit is investigating because there were no uh, known deaths here. For now, reporting live outside of MPD District for Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. Thanks, Casey. We know you'll follow it. We're still waiting to learn what.